Hey everybody, welcome to my channel. Thanks again for joining me today. Today I have um, kind of a fun project. I had recently switched um, into making my own foaming hand soap using Dr. Bronner's. I can leave links below to these um, uh, empty foaming disp dispensers. Um, that I got so check out the links down below. Um, here's the first one that I painted. Um, I used acrylic paint. You could use gouache if you didn't want it to be as shiny and it stuck really well. Now obviously I would be careful washing these just be gentle and um, not to scratch off the paint but uh, you could refill these a few times and be fine. And um, they would make great gifts um, and also you could change them with the season so you can paint pumpkins and Christmas themes and different kinds of flowers and things. I just grabbed a few of my acrylic paints and some purples and blues and some greens for the stems, um, some yellow gold for the uh, centers, and kind of dipped into a couple colors, kind of a pseudo one-stroke method, and uh, went to painting and <laughs> just to try that out. And I like how they turned out. I think it's a fun and a great way to give a gift, maybe you could give a bottle of the Dr. Bronner soap and a couple of these hand-painted um, dispensers, and that would make a really nice personal gift for Christmas or birthdays or uh, just a housewarming or a thank you or showers, all sorts of ideas. So just painting away, um, adding some blue in there now, just trying to get some different dimension. Um, one thing with making your own soap is um, <laughs> kind of really enjoy the Bath and Body Works, all the different um, sort of scents and um, the packaging is really pretty. And so, um, you know, you could use the plain Dr. Bronner soap and then go ahead and use uh, essential oils to change up the scents. And <clears throat> that would be fine. They sell one that is without a scent, so you could just use that bottle. And a little goes a long way. Um, literally you can just fill just like from the bottom of this container like maybe an inch up or maybe even three quarters of an inch or half inch of the soap and then fill a little bit of the water and give it a shake and you want to be careful not to get the water up near the um, dispenser part where it pumps it through um, but other than that you can fill it almost all the way full and get a lot of mileage out of um, one container of the Dr. Bronner's soap. So uh, very cost effective, even buying these um, on Amazon for a dollar something each. We were spending <clears throat> about $8 a bottle. And yeah, so these were pretty. I like how they turned out. So hopefully you'll give this a try. Uh, click like and subscribe, hit those links below. Thank you so much for joining me today and have a great day.